All right, guys, welcome back to another uh, Patreon request. And as always, if you would like to have a Patreon request done, just hit the link below, head on over there. Other than that, um, let's get into this. And this is a sequel to another story um, from Jack Oliver. And this is The Superior Ladybug 2. So if you guys remember, a few months ago when I did this, the first Superior Ladybug story, that story was basically... Um, a body switch. It was more or less a body switch story between uh, Marinette and Octavius, who um, he's uh, he. This is still Superior Spider-Man, uh, Octavius. Basically, in that story, it was essentially Otto and Marinette switch bodies, and Otto is like, oh, God damn it again, because <laughs> he's already like annoyed by all of this. He is just completely and utterly like just done with every he is he is quite literally done with um with all of this he is quite literally done with um with all of this nonsense so this is the sequel to the superior Le um uh the to the second story and this one is going to be a little more fun because this is not like a body switch story this is going to be like a full-on uh team up between the two so in this story um basically what it is is that um this is set a few months after the events of uh the superior ladybug and in here um marinette and the rest of uh francois dupont the class of francois dupont um, gets a new teacher. That teacher is Elliot Trolliver, who is... Uh, okay, so for reference, for those who don't know, there was basically um, a part when Otto was still in a, a clone of Peter Parker's body after the events of uh, Secret Empire, and basically what happened was he got a, a new body that was cl a clone of Peter Parker's body. It was his consciousness in the body and he became the superior octopus but then he went back to being superior spider-man on the west coast so that's where we are that's where, it was a short-lived series um from uh uh from marvel for a bit until otto went back to being a villain so yeah anyway so that is so elliot is elliot i should say is the new student is the new teacher from uh america who is going to be spending some time here and marinette goes hi otto and he's like hmm uh and he already knows who marinette is like because he was in her body and she was in his so she so they already know their ladybug and the superior spider-man and uh, and marinette like Talk, like Elliot, like um, Otto and Marinette basically have a one-on-one -on -one after class, and she's like, "What are you doing here, man? I thought we got we were done with each other after the whole body switch thing. I thought we were that we were done with each other." And he's like, "Yes, but unfortunately, we have a problem." And he's, and she's like, "Oh, what's what's the problem? Your problem." He basically says, "Your my problem is your problem, because now Shadow Moth, your villain Shadow Moth." has been gallivant has been sending villains to uh uh to the we to the west coast where i've been living basically he's kind of i think he's figured out that we were sh we had a body swap and after our little team up he's been he thinks that maybe i know something about about you so i came all the way over here to go find you be thankful i didn't just leave you alone i just didn't leave you to die and she's like, you could have just called me, man. I was like, oh, really? What's what's your phone number? What's your email address? What do you want also me to say? Hi, this is hi, this is Otto Octavius. You know, and you know, God forbid someone gets into your account. You idiot child! I cannot believe you've been you have all this magical destiny and you squander it. And she's like, all right, so. Why is he do like okay? So Shadow Moth is attacking you. What do we do about this? And he's like, simple. We go find him and we go bust him and we go as uh, as as uh, the real Spider Man would say. Uh, uh, we would go bust him up. And she's like, well, we're not doing that. Why did, would he even like be interested in you? And he's like, because I also believe like uh, he's more like Otto's just talking down to Marinette the entire time because he's like. Because I believe that he's working with someone I know. 
and that someone is someone I angered in a past life. And she's like, oh, really? You angered someone in a past life? Who, like, who would really be out for you? Like, who would be out for your blood, Otto? And he tells Marinette, does the name Roderick Kingsley mean anything to you? And it takes her a minute to figure it out. It's like, oh, you've got to be kidding me. So, yes, in this story, Shadow Moth is working with the Hobgoblin, um, Roderick Kingsley. So, if you guys remember, if you know your Spider-Man lore, Hobgoblin and, Sp and Octavius didn't really get along. So, and, remember, Kingsley was a fashion designer. So, in this story, um, they both were in the same, running in, uh, Kingsley and Gabriel were, work, or were running in the same circle, and then, eventually, like, the Hobgoblin and Shadow Moth met and collabed after the whole Spider-Man event. Because... Kingsley knows who who Elliot really is. He knows it's Otto Octavius. And after the whole thing with the body switch thing, he's like, well, here's the thing. We'll figure out who this ladybug is and we'll gain all this power. Um, so more or less what they've been doing is sending um, villain after villain, akumatized villains, to, uh, to flush out Otto and bring him to Paris because obviously he would come here. And so, so now they're both here. They're both now. They're a ladybug, a ladybug and Cat Noir are now working with Superior Spider-Man to um, be just caught out in the open, and that's kind of a problem. So, as, so it's a lot more difficult because, uh, like, Marinette even brings up the point of, I can't believe of all the people you and me got uh, uh, swap bodies. Like, yes, I could have picked someone else. I, I really do wish I'd pick someone rather than some belithering idiot girl who couldn't e uh, who can't even speak to the uh, uh, to a boy and she's like well at least I'm not a uh, at least I'm not a murderer and he, <laughs> so obviously it's it, this team uh, this one in this story it's not so much a body switch story it's more like an odd team up kind of story so the two of them have to battle shadow moth and the hobgoblin um throughout this story and meanwhile hobgoblin's got his own um he's got his own little like plan he's he's uh, concocting more or less what he really wants is the miraculous and not late marinette and, and adrian's what he wants is the miraculous that gabriel has and he manages to swipe them and becomes from hobgoblin to the hawk goblin um or rather, the Shadow Goblin. So, as the Shadow Goblin, he now has all this... Uh, like, he can create Senta Monsters. He can now, like, Senta Monsters with, like, that can shoot pumpkin bombs out of their mouth. Or, and even have, like, a Senta Monster as, like, his glider. Kind of going back to when Hobgoblin... During the second Hobgoblin, Jason McIndale had, like... Was the Demo Goblin for a short time. It's kind of, like, reminiscent of that. So, that's what they have to do. So, that's what the two have to do is battle the shadow goblin they have to defeat the shadow goblin and eventually and once they do kingsley gets away and he's like of course the little bastard and otto's like of course the bastard gets away but he uh, but knowing him he'll pop his head back up and once he is i will be ready and, and marionette's like we'll be ready and otto goes no 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 i i will be ready not you there's no we here child um, so yeah, so they just leave on, like, neutral terms by the end of the story. So, there you go, guys. Uh, you guys tell me in the comments below, what did you guys think of the Superior Ladybug 2? like to thank Jack Oliver for this story. There, there, it, This is a trilogy, so at some point I will get around to doing the third story. But other than that, once again, if you would like to have a request done, just hit the link below, head on over to my Patreon. Other than that... Uh, and hit the fourth tier, I should remember. When you get to Patreon, hit the fourth tier. But other than that, I'm Mr. Multiverse. I'll see you next time in the multiverse.